Good morning and welcome back. We are meeting Gypsy, your beautiful dog of the week. She's a little excited this morning. And uh, Regina Braven from Critical Care for Animal Angels joins us now to share her story. Good morning, Regina. Good morning. So let's talk about Gypsy. Well, tell us a little bit about what happened, how you guys came to, uh, to have her. Um, someone called us about a dog that had showed up at their house and she had been hit by a car. Mm -hmm. um, I believe they said that they saw her get hit by a car. She had uh, her pelvic bone was broken in two places. Mm. So, but uh, look, luckily she could control bladder and body functions, so we could work with her. She's all healed and all better. She's a great dog. She's very quiet. She's got the sweetest little eyes. The one they just like look at you. They're just so cute. Oh, she really wants to explore our news room, she's our very, studio. <laughs> she's very curious. Very smart. She's a hoarder. She takes things to her area and uh -huh. holds, on, um, holds on to them. What kind of dog is she? Um, she's an American Staffordshire Star Terrier. Do you know how old? Could you guess how old Three she year is? old. Three year old? Yep, she's about three. She's had puppies before, but she's spayed, she's microchipped. She's actually one of the few heartworm negative dogs we've gotten. Okay. So that was a good, uh, very good news for her. Tell us a little bit about her personality. You mentioned she's, she's a hoarder. Does she like to play? Is she pretty, or is she more to herself? No, she's great with the other dogs. She wants to be in your lap. She's a kisser. She's a cuddler. Mm -hmm. She's very outgoing and um, she's very sweet. Oh. Well, who would be a good family for Gypsy? She loves people. So um, kids, um, adults, whoever. She loves attention. Mm -hmm. So she's one of those ones that would be easy to match with a family. Does she need a lot of space? She has a pretty, pretty big dog. Well, she's in a house with other dogs now, so mm -hmm. just, just in, she would need a backyard with a fence. You need a backyard? But all our dogs have to be inside. Mm -hmm. all, our, all our dogs are inside dogs. Okay. We, so t tell us, how, for our viewers who are at home who are watching this morning, who maybe are interested in adopting Gypsy or any other dogs at Critical Care, how do, how do they go about doing it? Um, you can go on to our Facebook page and fill, or our new website. we got a new website. Oh, fantastic. I don't know the address. I'm sorry. <laughs> <laughs> I'll get it from you. I'll post it online after the show. I'll get it from you. Okay. Um, but you go in there and you fill out an adoption application. Um, from there, we do like a bit check. And then we come out to your house. Um, we deliver every one of our dogs. Mm -hmm. so, and then that's to keep them safe because right. we do have dog fighters try to get our dogs sometimes. So if anyone's interested in Gypsy or anyone else, they can just look it up online and be able to get a, a new home and a, a new dog or, and a new home for them? Right, or, or they can just call us and this weekend we'll be a Tratter Supply. All right, I'm so sorry, Regina, I'm getting in until I got to go. But thank you so much for joining us this morning. And if you want to adopt Gypsy or anyone else, just check out the group's Facebook page. It's facebook.com slash criticalcareforanimal.